These do not feel like $98. Can they do that? This is not what I was expecting. That's hardcore illegal. What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Clever Style. Woo! Lauren and Drew here. We're bringing you an in-studio version of designer versus dupes. This is the thing. We have a lot of designer items, or you see designer items on TV, or on TikTok, or on Instagram, and then someone's like, you know what? I know an item that is just as good, but for a lot less money. Mm -hmm. We are going to be testing a bunch of things that the internet claims is just as good as the expensive thing it's duping. I gotta know. Why do you cost so much? Why? Are you worth it? Why? I'll, I'll buy it. No, I probably won't. I'm pretty cheap. But, you know, I'll respect it. Okay, so we are going to try on four different clothing items. We're gonna touch them, see how they feel, see how they smell. I don't know what money smells like. We're gonna determine if they are dupes or if they are duds, which basically means we're gonna decide if it's worth the money or like if you should just go with the dupe and you know, pocket that for you know, Starbucks. Mm -hmm. Taylor Swift album. Thank you. Basically, and also, I'm pretty sure everything that we try today will be linked in the description below. So, if these dupes really are as good as the designer, that's what we're here for. Okay, guys, so the first item we're going to be inspecting are the Lululemon joggers. They're $98, and you guys know the deal with Lululemon. They're all the rage, everyone talks about them. Apparently, they're the best legging out there. So we're gonna put it to the test to see if the Amazon dupe for $30 is just as good. Okay. Okay. All right, I'm gonna try on the Lulus. And I'm gonna try on the dupes. These are the Align joggers. And I keep seeing Align everywhere. Like everyone's talking about the Align dupes. Oops. Everyone's talking about the dupes, not, it's like everybody wants to make the better, cheaper version of this pant. I mean, does it feel like Beyonce and Taylor Swift's skin? Which is your skin, let's be real. Does it feel like Drew's skin? That's the, that's does this one let almost me... took me out? I don't know what it would take for me to think that $98 is worth it. Okay, so mine definitely feel, you know, like your traditional legging. It's legging material, like the shiny type. They look like they have good support around the waist. We'll find out when I put these puppies on. The lining seems like it's nice. as pockets. We've touched them. You smell it? Yeah, I got my makeup on it. Okay, one, two, three. Not for 98 bucks, like what? I mean, they look good, but like why? So do $40 pants. Yeah, like literally, these aren't even $40 and they feel great, they look great. I think the color is almost identical. Even like the lining looks the Like same. literally those were made to rip these off. Yeah, and I think they did a great I job. they did a really good job too. Let me see your butt. No, stand straight. Like hold still. Okay. <laughs> Okay, so it's, it's cupping your booty. It is cupping. Is it? Booty. I feel like this is like cupping. You know you can't tell me that something is cupping my booty because I don't know how to act. Well, I'll take a picture for you. But yeah, there we go. Let me see your butt. Okay. Your butt always looks good. Your butt looks but phenomenal. It feels like these pants, the crack is going up my booty hole. Yeah, but I think it's supposed but to. But I think it's supposed to. Does mine do that, like that, that triangle dip? Or no, this part. Hold. Or is it straight across? It's triangular a little bit. Okay. It's like a soft upper T. Cause that is that triangle thing is like oh, really flattering. Oh, the Lululemon triangle. Yeah. No, yours isn't. You're just doing it more in the front than the back. Right. But like, whatever. I can't even see my butt. Why would I pay a hundred dollars for someone else's eyes? I don't. I say go for the dupe. Seriously, like these are good. These you don't are, need to spend money on them. Just paying. You're paying a hundred dollars for this little thing. No. That's what. Where is it? Does look good. That's what you're paying. I'll just cut that off. Glue it to those. Craft. Okay, people, next order of business are these cute blue dresses with ruching on the side. Mine is from Princess Polly. It's $67. And what's, what's Mine yours? is from Amazon. It is $13. Yours looks more expensive at first glance. Yeah, Does it that does. Make sense? It, no, totally, because it feels it feels the way it looks. Like, it feels expensive. Oh, Mine? oh my God. Yeah, it's thick. There is a difference. Yeah. This is like denim versus jeggings. So yeah. It's not the material, but that's what I want you to feel in your mind at home. Like this gives this you is, some support where this is just like you're wearing oh yeah. a t-shirt. Like a nice body con. Like what's that material in um, bandage dresses? Uh -huh. That's exactly. what this that material feels like. Like I bet, damn, your butt's gonna look good in that. Damn. I already know your it. Butt, your butt look, would've looked better though. <laughs> One, uh, two, yeah. three. <laughs> Woo! Lauren? What are you thinking? Lauren. Do I look like 
thirteen dollars, but it looked like one hundred thirteen. No, you look like three hundred and fifty dollars mm -hmm. in a Thanksgiving meal. Like you look so good. This is not what I was expecting for I after just touching both of these dresses. Not at all. This is the opposite of what I thought they would look like on us. Facts. Like I thought this would look potato sacky because it was kind of stretched out and just kind of cheat like. And the material. It just felt like nothing, and that felt like real like money. And well, it's complete opposite. Like you would expect this material, the, by the way it feels and by the cost, to like form to your body and give right. you some type of. Sh this is literally a potato sack. It's almost like it's the wrong material for ruching. It's completely the wrong. It like didn't do anything. Like ruching is supposed to do. It's supposed yeah, to do that. That's great. This is good news. I don't know why we're bummed. Duh. Yep. This is this is good news for you guys. Breaking news. Uh, we've just been informed uh, that this dress comes in twenty colors. Twenty. Twenty. Five times four. Ten times two. 20, four Math. times 20. Math. <laughs> wow, you could get five of these, four and a half of these dresses for the price of that. I like it. Can we just, I just, we have to have a moment of just hyping up this woman right here because <laughs> your boobs look great, your butt looks great, your waist looks insane, the color and your eyeballs. Again, there's another thing where I was like, I didn't like the color holding it and then I would not have bought this dress. This is the kind of thing you would have put me in Yeah. I would have trusted you <laughs> and I would have been very happy. So this is definitely not a dud. This is a dupe. Hardcore. Better. Better, actually. Okay, what's next? <sighs> we have pantalones! The funny thing about this round is Princess Polly was the high end of the last round. This one. And now it's the low end of this round because I have Revolve for 188. And I have Princess Polly for 74. Oh, how the tables have turned, Princess Polly. Uh. Okay, so apparently these Revolve jeans are called the crisscross and it's an internet fave. It does this thing with the with the it crisscross. It, it crisscrosses. Mm -hmm. And then I look over at Drew's pants. And it's crisscrossing. They literally ripped this off. Dude, this type of thing low-key makes me upset because it's like you know Revolve was like, ooh, we did something different. We made jeans obscure. Yeah. And then Princess Polly comes along and they're like, mm -hmm. And TikToked it. Yeah, I don't know how this is legal, actually. I think there's something like in the fine print with fashion that it's like it's not plagiarism, it's just inspiration. Yeah. That needs to change. These are crisp, these are softer. Oh, those are nice. Those look more vintage just because of the wash. Uh, yeah. Okay. Where these look these still look more expensive. Interesting. How does this Oh, whoa, 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 you got a billion buttons in there. This is not a pant that you pee in. Dude, if you're drunk and you're oh, trying dude. to pee fast, mm -hmm. game over. Just Wear a diaper. Just How do you put this back on? Oh, no, mine had the buttons too. <laughs> <laughs> of all things to do, why would they do that? Why would they do that? Okay, here we go. Okay. One, One two, two, three. three. Whoa! These shoes are made for for you. Dude, I am so obsessed with these pants, Princess Polly. This round is yours. Yours are longer, so yeah. the, I like the wash, I like the length. The only thing I like about the Revolve is this, and yours are doing that. Yeah. Like otherwise, these just aren't really doing much for me for 188. These are still expensive jeans, but like in comparison, since they're supposed to be the dupes, dude, I think the length you nailed it. The length is what sells it, and the wash, mm -hmm. straight up. It's the, it's just so straight all the way down, which I don't love, and I don't really think that that works on my body. So why would I pay a hundred? I don't know. If you can buy like if you're building like a dump truck, <laughs> then don't buy these pants, okay? But I will say though, even though Princess Polly ripped off the crisscross design, what I like that Princess Polly did is see how the revolve one is straight across. Mm -hmm. Whereas this, they like do a dip thing with theirs, which I think makes uh... it look more flattering on a women's waistline. Yeah. Yep. So the dupe. It's a dupe, not a dud. It's a dupe. It's, again, but more than a dupe. It's better. It's better. I think Princess Polly ripped it off and made it better. They did. Sorry, oh, Revolve. They you know did. Prince, her name's Princess for a reason. Ah, oh, dude. Polly, she's killing it. Okay, so our next item is a Vivian Westwood necklace. This is the original. It's $165. And yeah. this is questionable because this is $45. It's from Amazon and it it's not just a dupe, it is literally ripping off even the bag. Dude, that is like, that is hardcore illegal. This like there's is no way. Counterfeit. Like this is gonna get raided. It even has the symbol on it. Yeah, they're not even they hiding. This is like, uh, hey, let me copy your test. Okay, cool. Just make it look different. Can they do that? This looks like I'm about to propose to you. I do. I do. The bag is identical. 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 
like down to the little drawstring. Okay, what else? Little card. Like, come on. What? Can you imagine if just a single wheat thin was in there? A wheat thin? Wheat thins. Wheat thins. Mine says a lot. Yeah, it's like a book. It's a little story. I'm gonna need. A, I'm gonna need a magnifying glass. Handmade. Every item in the Vivian Westwood jewelry range. Mine's called Ron too. <gasps> is it British? Is she British? Maybe. Oh, it's the British okay. spelling. Jewelry. It's my favorite <laughs> color. So now the rest of this has to be read in a British accent. Each jewelry, jewelry model is, is handmade using, using the jeweler's traditional skills of engraving, piercing, fine smoldering, and so. You have an ant? I don't have an ant. Oh, we found a discrepancy! We found a discrepancy! Lauren, this is insane. They say the exact same thing. I'm dying. What the hell? Dude, that makes me really sad. This is from Amazon? Mm -hmm. No, you guys, this is hella illegal. Like, not even kidding anymore. Wait, wait, wait. What? What? Why does it have so has a... Does it have VivianWestwood.com? Yes! What? It has the URL! Are you kidding me? So does mine. That's a joke. Or wait, Jill, are you fucking with us? Is this the exact same thing? It's like someone literally, you know what they did? They catch me if you canned it. This is, I just watched it, Frank Abagnale. They Frank Abagnaled it. Do you think I can make a copy of this to put into my article? Okay, pause, but let's see the actual piece of jewelry, the actual thing that we're trying to compare to see what's happening. Oh my god, it's cute. Yours is a different, slightly different color. Is it? Yeah. Is it? Am I just colorblind? No, yeah, this looks like, okay. I do wear a lot of rose gold jewelry. I love rose gold. This looks like um, rose gold plated mm. or like painted. Okay, the, this one on my right is the fake one. This one on my left is the real one. And this little piggy went wee wee. The only difference we can really tell is the chain in this one is skinnier, and the the rose gold on that one is pinker. Also, can we just talk about the weight? How's your weight? I feel like that one's yours lighter. lighter. No, yours is lighter because it's plastic. No, yours is heavier for sure. Feel that again. Really? For sure. Whoa! Okay, I think for the first time in the episode, the designer is better than the dupe. Sorry. Ooh, and with yeah. jewelry, if I want, like this is just trying to rip off an expensive looking necklace, mm -hmm. which I don't even like this design. I'm sorry, Vivian, are you watching? I'm so sorry. Yeah, I mean, to be fair, it's very close. So close. Like you could definitely do a Ocean's 8 Sandra Bullock with it, you know? Literally. Dude. You know how much money you saved if you bought all the dupes? Tell me. $356. That's crazy. That's more money than I spend at Target in an hour. Which is saying a lot. I know, I know, I know. <laughs> well, on that note, teach us more. Please comment below more dupes we need to try because we love saving money when it is absolutely worth it. Huh. And then also giving credit to designers when it is worth it as well. And also, like we said, everything that we tried on is linked in the description below. And you guys, you know what to do. Click it, click it, click it, subscribe, click bell, close tap. Start tap, 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 tap things. Just, just click, click away.